welcome to Fitz on Flicks. I am Fitz. This is my friend Murph. Hey, Murph. Gotcha. Sweet. Hey, Murph. Remember we used to always talk about it'd be great if a movie could come out. We'd have Seth Rogen, Elizabeth Banks contemplating making a porno because they had no money. Absolutely. And we said that would never happen. No, it well, wouldn't. Guess what? Thanks to Kevin Smith that has Zach and Mary make a porno is in theaters now, and here's our review. Murph, do you want to tell the people what the movie's about? Sure. Uh, Kevin Smith wrote and directed this masterpiece of immense proportions, in my mind, mm-hmm. starring Seth Rogen as Zach mm-hmm. and Elizabeth Banks as Miri, mm-hmm. and they're best friends who are also roommates, and they lose their power, lose their water, mm-hmm. lose electricity. Low on cash. Which I already said. The low on cash. Low on cash. And they decide, let's make a porno. Right. Then let's make a porno and make some money. Everyone's been there before. They've all done it. Um, mm-hmm. Now, it should be stated, these two have been platonic friends since first grade. They've never had sex. They've never played, hey, where is it? They, that's not what they do. Um, but they think, hey, we're going to make some money and let's make a porno. But the question is, is it going to ruin the friendship? Um, when two friends have sex and they get a little too close and things happen and things are given to each other, you, that can affect the friendship. And that's the question in the movie. What happens to the friendship? Murph, mm-hmm. what did you think of this movie? I thought it was really funny. It was uh, definitely one of Kevin Smith's best movies, in my opinion. And uh, throughout the whole thing, there was a lot of jokes, a lot of laughter. I thought the performances were great. Mm-hmm. Craig Robinson. Oh, from The from Office. The, from the Office, Daryl. Daryl. Was awesome. He was really good in this. It was awesome. There were awesome. a lot of great performances. Jason Mewes. Jason Mewes. Could have never, been, never been better. Well, he's been a couple times better, but he did good. Yep. He was good. A different role for him. Justin Long. Yep. Was he was longing to see him play a gay porn star. Well, you get your wish in this one. Absolutely. Justin Long. And he has that funny voice in the movie. Remember? He's like... It was very low. Hey, 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 I'm Justin Long. I'm a gay porn star. That's what he sounded, he sounded like that He really movie. sounded nothing like that, but... <laughs> but in my mind, he did. And it was funny. I laughed. Um, this movie though, it's about, it's really, it's about the two of them. It's about Zach and Mary, oh, Katie Morgan and Tracy Lords are in it too, who oh, yeah. apparently are porn stars. But, Katie um, Morgan, not her best film, I will admit that. No, right, she showed, whatever. Um, but Zach and Mary, it's about them, it's about their friendship, it's about, will the friendship last if they do this, if they do this act, this sex act, on camera. Um, mm-hmm. you know, I, I didn't think it was one of Kevin Smith's best movies. I liked the movie. I, I enjoyed the movie. I thought it was a, I thought it was a good movie. But I mean, this is the guy that gave us Clerks and Clerks 2 and Chasing Amy. It's hard to get to that level again. Or maybe it's my bad because maybe I've raised the bar too high. Maybe I expect too much out of Kevin well, Smith. I've done that before. I've done that with the Zucker Brothers. I've done that with Alfred Hitchcock. Okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you know. No, I see, and I see what you're saying. It's, it's also that his later movies, as he's maturing as a filmmaker, I notice that there's more, uh, you kind of invest more into the characters and, you know, there's more uh, relatability and uh, it's pulling on your heartstrings a little bit. This is a movie, I, though, where poop landed on somebody's face. And I don't know how you can say you're maturing as a filmmaker when poop lands on somebody's face. Maybe it can, maybe it can't. But whatever. But I thought it was good. That's not a diss on Kevin Smith. I'm just saying, hey, a lot of this movie I laughed a lot, and some of this movie I would have laughed more probably 15 years ago. You know, when all, I was, you know, all I'm saying is the script is typical Kevin Smith. I'm talking about the filmmaking in general. The whole overall thing, he's definitely maturing in that aspect. Whatever. Yeah, sure, okay. You never had a film degree. No, I did. Oh, you did? Yeah, I got the oh. A. Congratulations. The A. Sweet. I am uh, Baracus. I want to say, though, I mean, I like the movie. I, I did enjoy it. Um, again, I don't think it's his best. I don't think it was Seth Rogen's best film. I mean, as I said, he was in Pineapple Express, which was phenomenal. I mean, that movie, Pineapple Express, that's like super bad meets any Quentin Tarantino movie. Funny, yet violent, sweet. Seth Rogen, I mean, he's becoming everyone's favorite Everyday, everyday Joe, Joe the plumber type of actor. This guy, he, um, we all have, we all have felt like Seth Rogen before. We've mm-hmm. all been in situations like him in different films. It, he's Seth Rogen's a great guy. He might play similar characters in most of his movies, but we're not sick of that yet. We actually no. like what you're doing, Seth. Um, I just thought it was a good movie. I, I didn't love it, but I'm saying, hey, if you go see it, you're not gonna be disappointed. I think you'll laugh. Don't go see it if you just want to see porno. Because there's a porno in the title, don't go thinking there's going to be a lot of sex and a lot of nudity. Not that much. You get some boobage, but yeah, that's yeah. about it. I don't think there are any butts. There's a couple like, There's a couple butts and a couple penises. Actually, actually one penis. There's one penis. Which is definitely worth a couple it. Times. It's but, definitely worth it. All right. That's sweet. Uh, but, you know, it's, yeah, it's, um, you know, you don't go because you're expecting 
porno and bang, bang, bang. But also, don't not go because it has porno on the title because it's I think, a little more poignant than that. Also, and it's fun and it's humorous and it leaves you warm inside by the end. Hey, also, real quick, before I forget, make sure you stay for the credits because three quarters of the way through the credits, there's take ten minutes more of the movie, which mm -hmm. this one didn't know. I was trying to play it off like I just... Oh, yeah, he just, knew. Yeah. We knew. So right. we're telling you, stay for that. Don't and, make uh, the same mistake I did. Don't do that. Um, so listen, honestly, check out this movie, though, if you want. I, I think it's funny. You'll enjoy it. If you go see it, you'll enjoy it. You'll enjoy it. Go Good see job. It. Okay, Kevin Smith, man, we're still with you. We like you. Yes. And uh, that's basically about it for now. So, hey, I'm Fitz. I'm Murph. And uh, we're telling you to make sure you... Check it out when if you want. And um, have a good time. We'll talk to you soon. Check us out on fitsonflicks.com and we will be talking to you soon, we promise.